You've been told your whole life that every natural number has only one prime factorization. But why is that true? If we start factoring 210, for example, initially there are many ways to break it down. It's 10 times 21, but it's also 2 times 105, and 3 times 70, and 14 times 15, and many others. But if we continue breaking down the factors until we only have primes, then we always get exactly the same result. 2 times 3 times 5 times 7 in some order. Why on earth should that be the case? It's really kind of spooky. The statement that every natural number has a unique prime factorization is called the fundamental theorem of arithmetic. And the ancient Greeks had a proof that it's true. But the proof is quite unusual because it relies on an algorithm. This was the first algorithm to be described, more than 2,000 years before there was any modern computer to run it on. It appears in Euclid's Elements, and today we call it the Euclidean algorithm. Tap the link below to see it in action and to understand why it comes up when we try to prove the fundamental theorem of arithmetic.